Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to my YouTube channel and today we are going to be reviewing Kevin 183's M416, Lego M416. So first we're going to show the stock. Five stud white and then the bottom is three stud white. Okay, so let's show the magazine. It's kind of wobbly. Rubber band. All right, I, this holds uh seventeen bullets, but I mean I lost all of my shooting random stuff in the house, so I only got one, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. I got fifteen bullets. So let me add them real quick. Oh, and this one. All right. So, oh, let me add the stock in the. So this is normal. But this is my favorite part where it's like this. Why is it not? Or it's like this. It's barely touching the one by fourteen or sixteen. I don't know. But right now, cause it's pretty heavy, I just keep it like this, so it doesn't break. So, oh, so right now, so we got this. I just saw Kevin one eighty three in the video. Just do this. So first, what I'm gonna review is the safety. So. You could shoot it, and then... So that's that. Then we got this. I don't know what this is for. I just see it in like a every AR. Then we got this. The dust cover, I think that's what it's called. Let's see when I put... Bro, I use the weakest rubber bands I have, and it's still hard to shoot. Like, I had to press really hard to pull the trigger, which hurts. I just showed you guys the safety. Oh, the tactical rows. Three studs. Two, three, top. Uh, iron sights. Let me see if I could show you. Right there. Dang, it does look like the PUBG gun. I remember playing PUBG. I right. so pretty sure you guys seen everything. Oh, and the uh, um, what is it called? Mag release or I don't know. Uh, tactical reload. Delay. So yeah, uh, so now I'm going to shoot it. I'm thinking, because I got two things right now. I got the target, this thing, and I got these pieces over there. And I don't know if I want to shoot the target, because if I shoot the target, the bullets are going to get lost, and I don't want that to happen. 
So I think I'm gonna shoot the pillow with the scale or the bulls, I think. So let me adjust it. Oh, how are you gonna see me, bro? I would need some type of mirror. Or. Alright, I'm putting the pillow over there. Hold up. Wait, but how are y'all gonna see me? What? Upstairs. Upstairs. Why? Hey guys, sorry for waiting. Uh, okay. So, I'm gonna adjust it. Nope, y'all guys can't see me. Can y'all see me? Nope, y'all can't see me. Alright, I'm gonna have to do uh gonna have to do targets. I try my best to uh I try my best to do the the square thing to so you can't see my aim. Alright. <clears throat> I'm doing this for y'all guys. I'm losing my bullets. What the? Okay. Damn. Damn. All right, guys, now I'm going to try to shoot the target. I know you guys can't see me, but I mean, there's nothing else I could do. It's so hard to shoot. And I got my weakest rubber bands, too. But a bullseye. I got six. So weird. Dude. I don't even know. I wish y'all guys could see me shoot it. I have bullseye again. I don't even know what I hit. The, the whole thing's just broken.
Guys, I don't even know what I'm doing. I'm just shooting it at this point. Alright, let me show you. Alright guys, that was me reviewing Kevin 83's gun. If you guys enjoyed the video, please like and subscribe and tell anyone else who, and share to anyone else who likes Lego guns. Um yeah, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you on next video. Peace.